What attracted you to Newport? Uh, I came to Newport about seven and a half years ago. I was coming from New York and the Berkshires and Connecticut, and I was looking to move to an historic environment that was by the ocean, um, that had these beautiful ocean breezes and foggy nights and uh, wonderful church bells and uh, unbelievable history. And I was really deeply moved by the fact of being in an environment where the United States of America was really put together in this little town. And um, I'm happy to be part of the town and um, that really is what drew me to this town. When did you first learn about Tom's concept or idea? Tom actually was talking about this um, probably was about 10 weeks ago and he wanted to use Pearl's as a location, Pearl's Boutique Hotels. So he came to me and then we started discussing his project and my background because I've done things in film and I've produced different pro projects and um, and in discussions, we realized that we had a relationship that should be pursued and he could tap into my experience base, my contacts in town, uh, along with his great vision and put together an exciting series. How do you feel about the art of William Hyde? Ah, you've touched the very soul of my being. Um, I really believe William Hyde is the next Norman Rockwell. And they have parallels in terms of their beginnings, um, where they were painting in these small towns and then um, generously giving their prints and signatures to works of art to the local town people. And Norman Rockwell and William Height both captured the essence of the historic towns that they lived in. The difference is that William Height is in a whole different decade and he's using vivid, beautiful watercolors, which are very difficult to do, and they're almost like paintings, like acrylics. And the, um, the design that he uses in his artwork is very specific to um, what he's capturing. Um, and it almost has a reality to it with a little muted edge. So I'm very excited to be close to uh, Mr. Height. And we're looking to open up a William Height Gallery at Pearls. So we're going to be doing an art gallery. And uh, we want to share this with the world. And um, I think the series will help, and I think the gallery will help. What are your personal feelings about Newport RI, the series? I think um, Tom C. Herb has captured um, a concept that will be innovative in terms of television. Television is really a very boring medium. Um, it's designed to be a low common denominator to appeal to the masses. And what we, Tom has done here, he's integrated um, a wonderful artist with a rare historic town and taken um, a group of actors and transpose them into the art and then he's going to pull them out of the art as they appear real and go through their various uh, roles portraying their uh, particular characters. Um, so they're going to take art and make art real. And I think he's got a very exciting project that will um, create a lot of attention. And I'm happy and proud to be part of this series. What is your role with the series? Uh, I'm executive producer. So I'm going to be uh, working with Tom to help bring his vision to reality. Um, and providing him with my contacts, my expertise, and my venue, Pearl's Boutique Hotel, to help make the concept a reality um, and put it on camera. Um, so I'm very excited to be part of that project, to be working with a very smart, innovative 
um, creator and I consider a Tom the father of the project and I'm happy to be close to him and close to Michelle and I'm taken back most by the number of people that Tom has been able to integrate into this project. This is not a little project anymore. This is a big project and it's got a big footprint in a small town and I think it will be heard um, for a long time to come.